Welcome back everyone. I am back to another video. I decided since you know my son doesn't want to go to sleep and you know I have time, might as well show you a new trend that's been happening. Well it's been happening for a while now but and I've had my eye on it, just haven't thought about doing it for some reason. Nevertheless, the foxy eye trend has became very popular due to Kylie Jenner, Bella Hadid. Um, the winged smoky eye is so beautiful. It elongates your eyes in such a way. And it looks like a really elegant look. And I decided that I would come on here and record it. It's super simple and easy to do. Um, so let's get started. So for today's look, I'm going to go ahead and use the Amrezy palette. I'm gonna go ahead and start with the 1988. Now I already did prime my eyes with the Milani primer and I did set it with my uh, Laura Mercier setting um, powder as well. So now I'm gonna go ahead and take a 1988 and what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take my M431 brush from Morphe and I'm gonna dip the, that brush in 1988 and so as if you were to create a wing liner, that's how we're gonna create this look. So very lightly and softly, we're gonna come to the very uh, bottom of the lid. And this look does not have to be perfect because it's a really messy look, okay? And so I'm just gonna pack it all in there. And then once I come, now it's also easy if you have an angled brush, it's easy to do it that way as well. It's probably, it's probably easier to do it that way, but all my angled brushes are dirty and honestly, this way I can also do it. So just as if you were to create that wing liner, that's what you're going to do. And if you're wearing one of those um if you're going for a more natural day and you want to amp up your natural makeup look you can definitely go in with one of these foxy eye foxy eyeliner i guess you could say and now what i'm going to do since i have that right where i want it i'm going to go ahead and blend it out so I'm just going to brush it back and forth. And remember again, it doesn't have to be perfect because it can be smoked out. See how that looks? Sorry guys, I have extension for those who don't know. I have lash, lash extensions and they're doing all kinds of stuff. I don't know what the heck they're doing. Um, I've been trying to take care of them as much as I can, but just wearing makeup, it's hard sometimes because you get the makeup on it. Okay, so now that I have that on there, I'm going to go in with my e.l.f. Um, what smudge brush and it looks like this. And I'm going to use that to apply a little bit more of the same product, same shade. So I'm just tapping. I'm going to tap it onto the lid. <coughs> yes, baby. Alright, so y'all see that? And I'm gonna go back with the same brush and smudge, smudge, smudge it out. Smudge it out. I can't say the word. See how that looks? Okay, and now I'm gonna go with Yugo, which is a more deeper uh, brown. Same thing, I'm just going to deepen that color up. Now you guys can do it whatever tone 
of shadow you want. I know a lot of people do it with black, a lot of people do it. Now I'm gonna go ahead and take this, what is this, a L'Oreal um, small brush, I don't even know what it's called, but I'm gonna use that to blend out the harsh edges, just so I'm able to work the product a little bit better. Like I was saying, you can use whatever shade you want. You can go within, with, go in with black if you prefer. But for me, I just like how the brown tones look versus the black for this look. Okay, and now once you get close to the edge, I'm gonna do this part at the end of the video. That way you can see it when I have concealer on because I don't have concealer on. Now, same uh, thing, going back with, in with my M431 um, brush from Morphe and using... All right, so now going back in with 1988. Have that on there. I'm gonna go in back with the elf brush. Yeah, I don't know, I don't know what that is. And we're just gonna dip, deepen that closest to the wing, I mean the eye. Now with you go. Yeah. That I'm gonna go ahead and put some concealer on, and I'm gonna go ahead with the Shiseido um, Medium Moyen, and um, this is just to, of course, to right up under the eye and clean any imperfections. So like if the wing looks a little funky, I'm gonna go ahead and fix that. And then with my damn beauty blender, you guys know the drill. Just going in and adding that on there. And I'm gonna go in with the concealer to clean up a little bit of this wing. Just so it doesn't look so harsh. Okay, now that we have that on there, I'm gonna, now we're gonna go ahead and do the inner corner and we're gonna do the um, elf brush with 1988. And the brush basically does all the work for you this brush is amazing. Okay, so now I'm going to go ahead and go in with my Morphe M514 brush. And this is just a fluffy brush. I'm going to go in with um, a New Yorker slightly, just a little bit for the under eye. Because I don't want too much color underneath the eye. So focus is basically this look right here. A little bit of OG as well. And now that I have that on there, I'm gonna go in with my Better Than Sex mascara and I'm gonna use that for the lower lids. Now I would be using this for the top lids too if I didn't have lash, lash extensions on. But, um, but you guys, if you don't know, now you know. I have lash extensions on. All right, you guys, this is the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed this as much as I did. I hope you guys recreate this look, this foxy, loxy look. Um, it's very elegant and very nice, very easy to do. Recreate it, have fun. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. I love you guys so much for sticking with me with another one. Till next time, bye.